Mr. Mark Kuntz joins us in studio for this week's Grogan's Town Big Play Breakdown. Hey, Mark. Well, thank you, Claire. You know, just about every level of organized basketball, you're going to see some form of the pick and roll. It's a basic play because basically it works every time if it's executed properly, which brings us to this week's Big Play Breakdown brought to you by Charlie's Dodge in Groganstown. And Rhett and Dan are going to take a look at a play from earlier this week between Waite and Scott. Guys? Thanks, Mark. You know this is our favorite segment, Rhett, so we get Go. to talk. Let's take a look first at the configuration. We're going to see the setup here. We see Stuck running the point guard, but we see a 1-4 set here. But what makes this set really nice, guys, is they switch it into a triangle, and then they run a beautiful pick and roll between Adrian Brown and Larry Mitchell. Let's run it, cameraman. So let's take a look here. Beautiful screen, boom, pop open for the nice layup. But I want you guys to notice something that you might not have noticed at home here. We're gonna take a look at my man right here, and that is Nicholas Heslett. Seems like it's been a Heslett at weight forever. Watch what he does, folks. He takes his guy, takes the defender all the way away, and there is literally nobody under the basket, no help side. Coach Owens, you drew it up perfect, and they execute it. Well, let's talk about the defense. Well, when, as a defense, when you play against the 1-4 high set, it's very tough to guard because it spreads you out, and if you're one or two steps out of position, it's gonna cost you. And we're gonna see here, on, as this play runs, they run that, you run that ball screen down lower towards the corner, which even makes it more difficult. You got Peterson fighting over the top. You got Barnett on a soft hedge. And then you said, Deanne, there's no backside help. If you look, we can see it again on the backside. Here it is, to the wing. You got Peterson fighting over the top of the screen. Barnett on a soft hedge. But Brian Shaw was about one or two steps. That's all, one or two steps out of position. He can't get to the roller in time, and it's an easy layup. And like you said, with the backside movement, it takes that backside wing out of help position as well. Great job by Coach Owens and wait on that, uh, on that play. And uh, like I said, you don't see the screen roll from that corner very often. So when you don't prepare for it, uh, it it's tough to guard. And your backside help better be there because if it's not, you know, it's going to cost you a buck and it, and it costs Scott there. All right, thank you guys. Of course, Scott did come back and, and win that game against Waite. Of course, don't forget to join Rhett, Dion, and I at 10 o'clock for Game Day Nation Overtime Edition. But for now, let's send it back to Claire in Game Day Nation. The Big Play Breakdown is presented by Grogan's Town Chrysler Jeep Dodge Ram.